lesson is on multiplying fractions. Yes, I said multiplying. And all my friends out there, you know how Coach Mike loves multiplication. So let's get to it. Here's our problem. Two-fifths times three-eighths. I love multiplying fractions. I love multiplying fractions because the denominators can be different. That is cool. All right, here we go. The first step I'm going to do is I'm going to cross cancel. I want to see if I can make this easier. Let's start with three and five. I want to think of a number that can go into three and five that is greater than one evenly. can't do it. I can't cross cancel 3 and 5. Now I'm going to move on to 2 and 8. I want to think of a number that can go into 2 and 8 that's greater than 1 evenly. 2. Let's do it. Two can go into two one time. Two can go into eight four times. Now it's time to multiply. We'll start with the numerators. One times three is three. Now, we'll multiply the denominators. 5 times 4 is 20. Now, we have to see if 3 twentieths is in simplest form. Can I think of a number that can go into 3 and 20 that's greater than 1 evenly? No, I can't. Therefore, 3 twentieths is in simplest form. times 3 eighths equals 3 twentieths. That concludes our lesson on multiplying fractions. Coach Mike at My Growing Brain. Challenge yourself.